So Wesley Hadsell, right? Let me just call him by his first name. The stepdaughter, right? Murdering the stepdaughter. It's still in question of if Wesley, say, uh, sexually assaulted his stepdaughter. His stepdaughter, because when she was found, right? Human decomp decomposition, right? Decomposing of a body, right? She was found with her pants down, right? So it's, it's the question is, did he sexually assault her? Like, sub, like, subscribe, ID in the Discovery Channel. Yes, ID in the Discovery Channel. The links are provided below. Get that Discovery Go app as well as an ID Go app. You might want to get those two things combined and make them into one. And I'm a Discovery Influencer. That's indeed a fact. So, Wesley, right? Hatzel was found guilty of his stepdaughter's murder. Just as I said in the opening, right? Before death, he forced the stepdaughter to ingest a lethal dose of heroin. But when it's in question of did he sexually assault her, because once again, I'm going to get to that, how when, you know, human remains are found and their pants were down, right? Stepfather, right? There, there have been stepfathers who have had sex with their daughters steps daughter stepsons that type of stuff goes on today right different practices people practice different things right a gps unit is, a gps unit is what helped in the pinning down right of the suspect to the crime scene that's what pinned the individual to the crime scene right a gps unit right angelica had so she was the victim and adoptive stepdaughter of wesley 18 years old, right? Be a stepdaughter, 18 years old, right? And, and the question of could there have been a rape or the sexual assault to know she was so young, right? This past Monday, Wesley was found guilty of first degree murder. That was first degree murder and concealment of a body, right? The victim, Angela, Angelica speaking so fast the victim angelica went missing while visiting the home of her parents around the norfolk virginia area back in 2015 all right wesley adopted his stepdaughter in 2012 yeah because see let me see to be 18 years old right not the question to, he adopted her in 2012 right I wonder it, because he didn't know that there was sexual assault right the questions right was there any anything that happened within the home sexually as well not just not just questioning uh, when her remains were found was there any sexual things that went on between the stepfather and the stepdaughter or something or if, if he say if he did sexually assault her right and that's how her body was found it wasn't that that wasn't the situation that's in question right but say if he couldn't have sex with her could that have been why she were murdered or something like that maybe he was the stepfather sexually attracted to her attracted to her or something like that and really couldn't get her in bed or something like that there'd be secrecy and stuff like that as well step parents stepfather stepmother when involved sex with stepkids right sometimes that leads to murder as well right so that's what that's what the question is what, what, during the time um him being a step parent could he have wanted sex and say not be able to get it and then some type of way situation where either he kidnapped her or something like that and then her remains are found or something like that could that be why she was murdered the sex stepfather wanting sex from his stepdaughter that's the question right authorities completed a search of wesley's van and found a shovel duct tape and work gloves right and a gps unit tracked as i stated before which led authorities to an abandoned house near north carolina right authorities found angelica's body partially buried a month after her disappearance right her body was found where wesley's van was parked and that was 50 miles away from the home of her parents right angelica right angelica was found near she was found laying face down right 
to be found laying face down under plywood. It was some plywood when she was found, right? Near a creek. Uh, that's sad in itself. Yes, stepfather, right? Homicidal violence was her cause of death along with acute heroin poisoning, right? The medical examiner couldn't determine if Angelica was sexually assaulted because insects, that, that's why they couldn't really determine if she was, yeah, sexually assaulted, raped, all the rest, right? Because animals as well as insects damaged her body, right? About the, the pants, how I said her pants was down when she was found, her, her remains were found, her pants were pulled down, right? Yeah, why well, your pants pulled down? Why, why was your stepfather involved in that, right? So going back in time, Wesley was charged in 2018 for Angelica's murder, right? Wesley has a criminal history of kidnapping. Uh, his estranged wife, robbery was also, is, is and was, right? When it comes to his criminal history, right? The kidnapping of his estranged wife, Ohio being the location, and robbery, bank robbery right so prosecutors claim wesley kidnapped angelica right to sexually assault her they claim he kidnapped angelica from her home it goes back to me asking right so kept their dogs right when it comes to this the sniffing dogs back in the day we used to call them sniffing dogs sniffer dogs that's what some of us still call them today right short name nickname right dog sex sniff pick up scent right of human bodies right human decomposing during the time that uh police search right it was the motel there, there there was yes the location motel where wesley lived police also found nine millimeter ammunition and heroin remember it's stated heroin was involved the lethal dose was involved in angelica's death right but that's also what police found at the motel when they searched where Wesley lived, they, they found a nine millimeter ammunition, right? But the heroin, in which I just mentioned, remember she died from a lethal dose of heroin. So maybe that's where the connection, the victim died from a lethal dose of heroin, right? Found out stepfather was involved, but that's also what police found was heroin at the motel where he lived. And the nine millimeter ammunition, right? A post mortem hair analysis showed and proved Angelica didn't have history of drug abuse, right? Wesley is to be sentenced to life. Stepfather. What a what a stepfather. I was going to say molest, but to know she was of age, would a stepfather rape his stepdaughter, right? You would question that. The stepfather rape or molest his stepchild, right? What would be the intention? We're on investigation discovery dot com. The ID logo stands on the far left corner, right? Stepfathers and rape, stepfathers and molestation, stepfathers and murder, right? Cause, Cause, sometimes, how you know? Wait a minute. Oh, family secrets done raped or molested someone in the family, right? And usually that'd be like a family secret, but some people just kill you instead of it being a family secret, right? Maybe that was a situation or something. Instead of instead of having it be a family secret, right? gonna kill her or something to rid the family secret because it all goes back to the question of was there sexual involvement before she was killed not right before but to know he was the stepfather was there any sexual involvement before then were there any issues with that is that could could that have been the reason why he killed her or something but sometimes you can be sexually involved, right? That's not to say that happens. Sometimes you can be sexually involved uh, with a victim or something, and the victim not want to be sexually involved anymore or something like that. Or say they're going to tell or somehow even young kids say, I'm going to tell, and then they end up getting killed by the person that was 
sexually abusing them or something? That's what the question is. It's a story. This story. It just is. So, dear viewers, let me know what you think and feel about this video. And um, may you enjoy your day. I want to enjoy mine. Put a comment in the comment section what you think could have happened. Why did she end up dead? And why did he end up? Who's going to serve possibly life? Yes. The sentencing. The sentencing. Sentencing. Let me say my words correctly. It's so early. To sentence someone. That's the proper way to say it first. Let me know what you think and feel. May you enjoy your day. And I will in fact enjoy mine. And I'm gone for now. One.